Today we're gonna be trolling fast to catch a some walleye. I'm gonna show you how I do it. Let's go. So first things first, when trolling fast, you gotta tighten your dipsy because it's gonna just pop right out. So I'm using my screwdriver, just tighten it up just a little bit so that way it doesn't just pop. Right now we're getting some really good marks right under 30, in between 30 and 40 feet down. We're going about three and a half miles an hour, a little bit faster than that, in about 41 feet of water. I'm gonna show you guys how to catch these fish going fast. I think I actually got one on this first line already. I'm gonna check it right now. I mean, I just put this line out and I think I got a fish on it already. I'm gonna check. Oh, it feels like it got some weight already. Trolling fast is, uh, it has a lot of benefits. Thing is, when trolling fast, you can cover a lot of ground. They'll still chase after it. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that, guys. We're trolling at about 3.8 miles per hour right now, and we're catching walleyes like this. Not too bad. All right, I'm gonna get this lure back in, nice big lure, see if we can get some more. Nice. So we're catching them on this, guys. It's a big lure. There's a reason that I'm using big lures today. Mainly is because I'm going fast. The speed that I'm going, it's gonna give that big lure a lot of action. Fish are gonna see it, they're gonna wanna bite that. Okay, okay. So I think I've been dragging a fish for a while. It has some weight to it. I wanna see how it is. We are covering a lot of area going fast like this. We know we got a lot of fish in the area. We can hit them up pretty quick. That one's okay size, about the same size as the last one. The lead is a little bit long on there. Ah, there we go. Still catching walleye, guys. Still catching some walleye. They caught it on the spoon. Look at that. Really about the same size as that last one, but we're still catching them. Going fast. Speed does not hinder you catching those walleye. They have to be some active walleye, though. All right, to the next one, guys. Peace. It's summertime, guys. These walleye are pretty active. You can't just go fast any time like this and expect to catch walleye. They have to be an active school of them for you to be able to troll fast and catch them like this. All right. I did definitely see a hit on this one. It's a lot of boats out. This is a 4th of July weekend and everybody is out. Everybody. And I'm wondering if people are catching fish out here. There it is, it's looking good. Looks like it's around the same size as these other ones. It might be a little bit bigger. There we go. Woo! That joker tried to jump out the net. And that's what we're talking about. 3.1 miles per hour right now. Nice walleye, y'all. Nice walleye. Nice looking walleye. Still catching them, guys. And it's not even taking that long either. All right, I'm gonna get this lower back in the water. Ice. Oh my, oh my. That was a big hit. Really big hit. Keep it on there. Oh man, this dipsy is tight. Dipsy is tight, I'm fighting the dipsy and the fish. I just gotta take my time with it. Oh my goodness, it's a big, big hit, guys. Biggest hit today. Okay, it's at the top already. So that's just the weight of the fish, oh my goodness. This thing is a, a big fish. I'm gonna see this thing. I can't see it, I can't see it, guys. Oh my goodness. This thing is a monster. I'm thinking I unset the, I didn't unset the dipsy. Stay on there. Usually when it's like this, I always think it's foul hooked, but this thing is staying down. Oh my goodness, that's huge. Is that a freaking catfish? Holy cow. Oh my goodness. No freaking way. No way. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh my goodness. Who would have thought? Oh, oh my goodness, guys. 
Who would have thought? Oh my goodness. No freaking way. No way. No way. Look at that thing. Oh my goodness. Look at this, guys. Caught a freaking catfish out here trolling for walleye. Trolling right now. I'm about about three and a half miles per hour. But a freaking catfish. No way. <laughs> uh, this thing is thin. I am not gonna keep this, guys. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get this back in the water, get my lure back in. Peace. Oh my goodness. got like a small hit on this one. I'm betting this is a junk fish. Trying to troll fast, you gotta really pay attention to the boats that's in front of you, the boats that's around you. Also, you can't use planer boards. You can't use planer boards because the line won't stay set in there and it'll, it'll keep tripping. All right, we've got another walleye right here. Looks like I'm gonna flip this one up. It's not a junk fish, but this one is small. The small one, guys. <laughs> Little one going back we need bigger but we're still catching some walleye guys Ooh, that snapped easy you got anything on here we do we do we got to get it off what is this white perch white bass <laughs> i don't want that now Not sure what happened with this, but I think we got a nice fish on here. It looked like it was unset, but it wasn't. We got a couple of junk fish, but we're still catching some walleye. That looks like one right there. A couple of them have been small. Oh, it looks like this another junk fish. It's a white bass. Another white bass, y'all. This is a decent sized one, too. All right, I'm gonna get this back in. Ice. Checking this line, see what's on. We got a couple of junk fish, but hopefully this is a nice eye. The wind has picked up a bit, so we got a little bit more waves. We're trolling into them now, getting a little bit deeper water. Ooh, it's got a little fight to it. Oh yeah, it looks nice from here. All right, come on, come on. Oh, that's a nice one, guys. Nice one. There we go. Nice one, guys. We are out here trolling super fast into these waves. Trolling real fast out here on Lake Erie and catching fish like this. This is what it's about. That's it, guys. Look at that. This is a real nice one. Get my lure back in, catch some more. Let's go. Okay, okay. I got another one on here. This one got, got some weight to it as well. It's not fighting me or anything, but it just has a constant pull. Yeah, kind of like he big. He ain't that big. Look at this. Acting like it was big. <laughs> This one going back. All right. Feel like I got something on here too. Got something on all my lines, y'all. So I'm not just catching big ones at this speed. I'm catching small ones as well. Look at this, <laughs> another small one. <laughs> all right, gotta get this back in. I wanna send a thank you out to Matthew from Top Stripe Fishing. He sent us out these lures. There's some nice spinners. They said they look really good underwater. They have a nice flare to them. We're gonna try them out trolling today and see if we can catch some walleye with these. Thing is, I may have to swap this hook out. It's a pretty small hook for walleye, but we'll try it out and see how it is. Actually, no, I'm gonna go ahead and swap it out now. 
I'm gonna swap and put a bigger hook on there. I like that it has a swivel on there though, so that way you can swap out that, that hook pretty easy. Took this hook off and then put this one on. So a little bit bigger hook. I think that'll work better for us for walleye. Get this in the water, see if we can catch one. All right, heist. I saw a bump, not sure if it was a hit, but I'm gonna check it out and see. Yeah, it feels some weight on it, so it might be. Oh yeah, looks like it got us a fish on it, guys. So this is with the uh, lure that Matt sent from, uh, from Top Strike Fishing. So we're trolling. We did change the hook on that. Looks like it got us a waller. All right, We're getting us a walleye. <laughs> We're gonna get this one back in and catch us some more. Ice. All right, again, thanks to Matt from Top Strike Fishing. Got us this nice spinner lure, looks really good. So I've been dragging this for a little bit. I think it might have a fish on. Oh no, that's a decent one on there. I see it over there. Again. Another one caught with the spinner lure. I think what I wanna do is actually put a single hook on there and actually put a worm on it. I don't have any worms today, but when I come out again, I'm gonna get a single hook and then put a worm on there and that'll be pretty good for catching the walleye as well. All right, I'm gonna get this one back in. All right, peace out. We got a fish on. We got another one. Let's, let's see here, do a flip. Smaller one, y'all. Look at that. Tiny, get it back in. This one got some weight, weight. Hold up. I've been paying attention to the lines, so I don't know why I would have missed this hit. We gotta keep this one on. We gotta keep this one on. There we go. All right. Look at this. Got us another eye. Trolling fast out here on Lake Erie, it is possible. You can do the same thing as well. Thanks guys so much for watching. Let me know what speed you would wanna be trolling at. I was trolling around three and a half to four miles per hour all day long and catching walleye like these. Like, comment, subscribe, and always keep fishing. Let's go.